All right. So here's the next example. So here's the, uh, the exercise. Uh, we have two points, P and Q, with the following coordinate, 1, 3, negative 2 for P, and 2, negative 1, 3 for Q. And we need to find uh, the vector equation. And once we find the vector equation, it's very easy to, uh, come up to, to write the parametric equation uh, for the line segment. Not the whole line, but just the segment. So going back to the to chapter 12.5 from section 12.5 chapter 12 we have the following equation of uh, of a segment Anybody remember Go ahead. That is good. That's exactly what it is. So uh, where uh, where R's are not and R one are position vectors. So in this case, uh going to have, actually we, there is one more condition this for the segment to be a segment, because if we don't write it then this will be an equation of a line the segment will be where t goes from 0 to 1 and you can see that when t equals 0 right. then uh, r of t is equal to r sub 0 or r naught and when t equals 1, r of t is equal to r1 so uh, t equals 0 refer to 1 in the point and t equals 1 refer to or correspond to the other endpoint. R naught will be the position vector correspond to P, so it will be the vector 1, 3, negative 2, and R1, of course, will be the position, position vector correspond to Q, or 2, negative 1, and 3. And we can work, continue to work on the next page. So let me split the screen. So uh, let's spell R of T, spell it out. So it would be uh, 1 minus T. And the first R naught is 1, 3, negative 2. Uh, and then we have T times 2, negative 1, and 3. And if we clear the parentheses and we collect all the components, so the first component will be, um, let's see, 1 minus T plus 2T. So it will be simply 1 plus T. The next component will be 3 minus 3t minus t, so 3 minus 4t. And the last component, uh, we have negative 2 plus 2t plus 3t. I'm sorry, minus 3. Uh, 
plus 3t. So let's do it again. Negative 2 plus 2t plus 3t. So negative 2 plus 5t. And this is the vector equation. So here's one answer, the PE. x equals 1 plus t, y equals 3 minus 4t, and uh, z equals negative 2 plus 5t, and I forgot something? What did I forget? I'm sorry, Michael, but you're mumbling. Say it. Right. This has to, uh, we have to include this in in the in the solution otherwise we have a line rather than a segment same here for the parametric equations <coughs> 